Hello everyone, uh, today I'd like to help you to start streaming uh, to Twitch uh, from your Mac using OBS. Uh, I'll try to make this as structured and easy to follow uh, as possible. So there's been a new release of OBS which works for Mac. It's not official but it works. Uh, so let's start it up. Uh, OBS works in the way that you have scenes and you can choose what you want in each scene. But let's start by reviewing the settings. You can choose your language, which one fit you, fits you the most, but I'll stick with English. Then you go to stream, you choose your streaming service, uh, which should be Twitch. The server closes to you, and then you have to enter your stream key, which you can acquire by going to dashboard on Twitch when you're signed in. Go to stream key, Show the key, copy it, and paste it here. Your output defines your video quality. Uh, you can have 5000, uh, which is very high. Uh, you need very good internet for this. You can have it lower, you can have it higher, you can experiment with it. Uh, the audio bitrate, you can choose, I have 256. This I don't mind. I don't even bother with the audio, and the video is important though. The base resolution should be the one you have on the screen you want to stream from and the scale resolution uh, should be 1080p. That's everything we have here. So let's start building a scene. Uh, first you need to add a display capture and here you can choose which screen. I have two screens, this one and this one. I'll choose this one. Okay. Now this is what would be streamed uh, if we started now, but we want more. Uh, for example, we want an overlay, which many of you want. So I have one prepared. Uh, here it is. Now this one is not the appropriate resolution, but I'll scale it to that one. Uh, if you want to move it freely, hold command. Uh, and if you want to change the aspect ratio, hold shift, like this. Uh, now, the last thing we need uh, is audio. And to make the audio from the game and from your microphone uh, go together into the stream, we need two applications. They're both freeware, and I'll link the download links in the description. So the first one is Soundflower. Let's start it, and it comes up here. The second one is line in, and you'll need to duplicate a version of it, so you get two. You start them both up, and here you have them. Now, the settings they should be on is built-in microphone to Soundflower 2 channel, and Soundflower 64 to Soundflower 2 channel, uh, as it is now. Then you'll go to your system preferences, sound, output, 64 channel, Soundflower, input, internal microphone. Now you'll hear yourself speaking, and to avoid this, go up here in the menus tab and choose Soundflower 2 channel off. So now your stream will hear you speak as well as your in-game sound, which is what we want. Now, for different uh, occasions, uh, you might want different scenes, and it's just to arrange it and add images and overlays as much as you want, uh, and then switch between them. Uh, this is everything I want to go, uh, go over in this tutorial. So if you have any questions, uh, please let me know in the comments, and I'll be happy to answer them. And if the video helped you, leave me a like or send me a message. Thank you very much for watching.